I'm actually going to be on uh, the Barstool betting website oh seeing God. if she brings this up at the uh, at the Ghislaine trial because she did bring it up at the uh, at the uh, Weinstein one. But basically, she was able to convince, uh, I believe, about 25% of participants, which I got to say, not that high, uh, that they had been lost in the mall as a child and been found by sort of a kindly older stranger. This did not happen to these people. Um, but she was able to suggest that their parents remembered it did. And so, you know, upon further questioning, they also remembered this. And some of them, I believe, will remember details and stuff like that. Um, that supposedly proves a, a number of things. One is that it's possible for someone to implant false memories on somebody, right? Mm. That you can, you can have somebody have a memory. Although I, I guess to me, sort of the definition of memory here gets a little hazy and you kind of get a little philosophical on it because it's not a memory, right? It's, mm. it, it's, a, it's a scene that this woman implanted in their mind that maybe they're filling in with, you know, this is a sort of, a, you know, they've been kids in a mall before. Maybe they've encountered it. I mean, I actually, I do have a vivid memory of being lost in a... Um, supermarket as a kid oh i implanted uh, that that's fake yeah well the good thing with supermarkets you just go to the front of the supermarket they can't leave any other way so you're not gonna get lost there um i ended up working there for seven years my parents had left Jeffrey Epstein. Jeffrey Epstein. Jeffrey Epstein. Jeffrey Epstein.